Hey, Ian Gordon here from the Brock University Library. I'm a science librarian and one of many people in the library that help provide collections, services, and research and teaching help to you and other people across the campus. I'm here to just introduce you to things about the Biology 1P91 quiz, which is in Sakai. Uh, when you do the quiz, make sure to know when to start it and when it ends, how many times you can take it, but use the resources embedded in the quiz to learn more about uh, what the Brock Library has to offer. The library quiz will make use of the Brock Library, and this is our website here. There's many tabs that you can look at. One of the important ones is the Research Help tab, which shows you when things are open, what things are being useful, uh, to book a consultation, a chat, and workshops that we offer through the school year. Um, also, how to use the library and interlibrary loans and other important resources as well. And when to search, what databases to use as well. Uh, our library shows you how to use Omni, which is on our homepage. I usually use the advanced search option as well. Make sure you watch the tutorials to show you how to effectively use it to look for books, ebooks, open educational resources, uh, and how to find papers in particular journals and magazines and newspapers as well. Uh, let's search Omni for a book. So we know the title, uh, Writing uh, Undergraduate Lab Reports. Do I have to look at? And we know it's not a paper, it's not a streaming video, but it's a book or an ebook. When I search and it is affirmed that we're here, it gives you a link for that as well. So we do have this book in the library, and it is in an online format. To find other books in the library, look at our guide for that. But you can look at uh, report writing as a subject, and let's put the word bio, any word with that root, biological, biology, biological sciences, and find out how many books we have. It says that there's 17 books. I only want online books. I don't have to go to the library for it. I want to sort them from newest to oldest to see what we get. Got the book we're looking for, and there's other books that we could use as well, all virtual, all available from home, from your computer as well. So when you come to the Brock Library, make sure you use Omni and the advanced search interface looking for books or articles or papers. And this will be important when you do your library quiz as well. To go back to our library homepage, there's a number of resources, news, and features that you can use as well. Click on Research Guides. And there's research guides for each faculty and each department. And Biological Sciences is the guide that you want to look at. In the Biological Sciences, you'll see my picture, my email, my book and consultation tab, and other important tabs as well. Writing and citing, how to use and think to use Zotero, uh, handbooks and style books, how to write important lab reports and presentations. Here's the book we just looked at. Other books that may be important to you that are in print, but most importantly, usually are in an electronic ebook or digital format that you can look up as well. Writing and citing, definitions helps you to find uh, definitions for things in common encyclopedia, digital handbooks, and dictionaries as well. Uh, finding books and articles, it, books in our library is certainly uses Omni. And there's open educational resources that help you find those sorts of things. They're free textbooks that are available online that are linked to this particular guide. Google Books is here, but yet more importantly, how to look for articles, the number of databases that you can use, as you move through your career, you'll learn uh, which ones are important, how they're used, how to use them effectively to find materials that are available for you for consultation, maybe to include in your lab report as well. Let's go back to our home page, research guides, biological sciences. That's about it all. Complete the assignment. Note how many times you can take it, when it's open, and certainly when it's closed how to know what your best score is, and make sure you use the resources that are embedded in the quiz. You'll learn about how to write lab reports, citation management, what interlibrary loans is and research, how important that is, what the concept of peer-reviewed scholarly research is and how to identify materials, open educational resources, uh, ORCID IDs, and how they affirm who people are, uh, DOIs, which are numbers for articles and materials, uh, and a number of searches. You'll be able to search Omni, our database, like I showed you, Google Scholar, Google Books. Uh, you go through a number of things. Uh, hopefully, you'll have a, this as a learning opportunity as well. The last thing that we learned about is plagiarism. Really, this is probably one of the most serious offenses in any academic institutions. Uh, the things I remember is when you look at something, don't plagiarize, don't copy, or don't cite properly. Make sure you cite properly. 
I always say this, if in doubt, cite. If you're not quite sure, ask for assistance from your lab instructor, your TA, uh, colleagues, the senior colleagues. Uh, we can help with that as well. Don't be caught plagiarizing. So here you go. Uh, try the quiz and see how you do. And good luck on, have a great year. Um, all the best from me and Gordon, your science librarian.